Hey guys, in this video we're going to convert the hexadecimal number E7A9, which is base 16, to base 10. So let's go ahead and get started. First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to rewrite our number. So we have E7A9, that's our hexadecimal number. And what we want to uh, look at here is the index, so the place that each digit is in. So we have 0, 1, 2, three and now what we're going to do is we're going to multiply um, the symbols e7 a and 9 times 16 to the power of that index so we get e times 16 to the power of 3 because our index down here was 3 plus 7 times 16 to the power of 2 because our index down here was 2 and so on, so plus a times 16 to the power of 1, because we have the 1 index here, plus 9 times 16 to the power of 0, because we have 0 here. All right, so now you may be thinking, well, okay, that's all fine and dandy, but what is e and what is a? Well, in hexadecimal, our a value is equivalent to the number 10, B is equivalent to the number 11, C is equivalent to 12, um, D is equivalent to 13, and E is equivalent to 14. All right? And then, of course, we have F, uh, which is equivalent to 15. So that means that I can just replace uh, e, for, with e with 14, and I can replace A with 10. So let's rewrite this again. So now we're just going to replace them. So now we have 14 times 16 to the power of 3 plus 7 times 16 to the power of 2 plus 10 times 16 to the power of 1 plus 9 times 16 to the power of 0. All right. And so if I'm doing my math correctly, this is equal to um, 5, 7, 3, 4, 4 plus... 1792 plus 160 plus um, 9. Alright, if I add all that up together, I get 59305 five, in base 10. And so that is our answer. The number E7A9 in, in hexadecimal is 59,305 in base 10. All right. So thank you guys for watching. I hope this video was helpful. Uh, please leave any questions you have in the comment section. Don't forget to hit that like button and that subscribe button. And if you found this helpful, please share it. And as always, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see you all in the next video.